updated forecast for the weekend. And Patrick, uh, you know, we have this uh, ocean storm that we've been seeing our computer models uh, hinting at developing all week, but it's looked like it was going to stay well out to sea, sparing us any significant accumulations. But uh, that may be changing. I'm looking at some of the latest data in right now, and I'm growing a little bit more concerned about the potential for at least some moderate accumulations in our area, and the timing of that would be Saturday night. I'm going to get to a lot more of those details here coming up, but I want to start off this morning because if you're headed out, uh, unlike last Friday, we were tracking the blizzard coming in this morning. It's dry and in fact, temperatures up near 50 this afternoon. So the top headlines for us heading into this Friday. It's a very nice finish to the work week, mostly sunny and mild. Very tricky weekend forecast because things are evolving so late in the game. You know, we're still trying to um, get a better grip on what's actually going to transpire for the weekend. But there is potential at least for accumulating snow. And I do want to put that out there been trying to get a babysitter for Saturday night to go out and I know uh, a lot of people heading out because it's been tough to get a babysitter but um, if you do have plans definitely check in on the updates for the future cast because it may become difficult to travel Saturday evening and Saturday night live city cam over Providence right now around 27 degrees taunts at 27 Newport's at 37 right now winds light from the southwest that shift to the wind to the southwest bringing in that milder air and is going to help boost our temperatures up for today so here's what I'm looking at for this afternoon coming in around 48 in Charlestown 49 Hope Valley 48 in Coventry Wickford at 49 temperatures in the northern part of the state in the upper 40s, mixture of sun and clouds. Uh, more melting today, certainly with these sort of temperatures. Cumberland, situate, 48 degrees and making a run at 50. I think we'll see maybe just below that in most areas. I have us at 49. Fall River, New Bedford, Seekonk at 49. Middletown today around 47. All right, so the deal is we're going to have a storm develop this weekend over the ocean. The big question is going to be how close to, does it come to us? Here's Rhode Island, southeastern Massachusetts. So scenario one would bring moderate accumulations to us if it tracks closer to us. I don't think we're talking about the sort of amounts that we saw last weekend, but enough certainly to bring back out the plows and the shovels. Scenario two would be a track further away with a storm system that would uh, keep most of the snow offshore. I mean, there's a huge range right now in the tracks from our computer models, some of them bringing uh, no accumulations at all, and some of them bringing in spots a foot of snowfall. So right now what I'm looking at in terms of the accumulations from this storm system would be maybe as much as three to six inches, but obviously we're still fine tuning this forecast. So I'd certainly recommend check, checking back in for updates. Today is nice and quiet. Timing wise, we're looking at light showers, maybe both rain and snow during the day on Saturday. I don't think much in the way of accumulations before dark on Saturday night, potentially heavier at night. Snow ends through Sunday and again, check back in for updates. So Sunday starts off a little snowy, but some improving conditions through the day. Windy on Sunday. We may see wind chill values in the single digits at times on Sunday afternoon and especially